Kaso syempre. Okay. Ang ganda ng facade. Simple <laughs> lang. That's true. That's true. <laughs> Apart from the materials, yung design mismo, very classy. That's my fault. <laughs> Uh, and I love that it's only two floors. At least from the front, it looks like it's two floors. I don't know Let's see. if it actually has more than two floors. We'll find out. Yeah, there's a basement. Hey. Hindi pala tayo nag-doorbell, no? Hindi tayo nag-doorbell. Pero... Oh my gosh, it's so solid. Hindi lumalasap yung sound. Ay. Hi, Architect Hi. Philip. Good Hi. afternoon. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for welcoming us into one of your projects. Today we are doing another pre-solo BYO or build your own. Yes. So, but before that, make sure you hit like, click, subscribe, and click on the bell to get notified for whenever we release new YouTube videos like this one. And we're on Facebook, so make sure you hit like and see first and follow us on Instagram at pre-solo underscore official. Thank you. First of all, thank you for featuring us here. And it's a pleasure to work with Priscilla. And uh, these are one of our projects. Uh, we design uh, luxury homes, mm -hmm. uh, most of the time here in Ayala, Alabama as well. And uh, we do resorts and hotels as well. Ah, yeah. It's a really high-end so market. So if you're interested with our services, you can always click on the link below. Yes. And Find the link in the description down below. Mm -hmm. And how do we get in touch with you? To make it easier for everybody, I just uh, go to Priscilla's website and we'll take care of everything for you. Yeah, so their link will be in our website as well. So yeah. this again is one of their works. So if anything, this will show just how good they are at what they do and the kind of style. So would you say that this is one of your favorite projects? Something that embodies your body of work? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Is it? Is it? Yes, it is. Uh, mm -hmm. In fact, this is one of our favorite projects. And uh, because we really want to pay attention to the details, especially on a massive scale as such. And aside from this one, our company also extends uh, interior design services. And one of our strengths is actually the interior fit out as well, the construction mm. of the interior fit out. Okay, so this is going to be a great sample for them to see about what you can do. Yes, yes. Okay, Thank you. all right. Thank you, Thank you Architect Philip. We you will be, Ria and I will be going around your project and Hopefully, you'll be able Feel to free. tell everyone the nice little details that you put into this project. Thank you. We'll okay. So. Thank yeah. you. Thank you, architect. And I'll see you later. Bye, bye, bye. Okay. Okay, so architect Philip mentioned that this project was massive, right? Yeah. It actually has a 2,000 square meter lot area. Wow. And the house is 1,500 square meters of floor area. So I it can see is that though. From the outside, palang oh, no, no, it has a massive facade that's not overbearing, yeah. right? And speaking of overbearing, what's not overbearing is this wall. Considering this is six meters high of quartz, 
This wow. is pure quartz. And that's very expensive. Okay. A three meter <laughs> quartz wow. slab. Hindi na lang yata siya kita sa camera, but there's a line in the middle because it's three meters each. And interestingly, this is actually a or an elevator shaft. Oh, okay. So, nice. look at this one. The elevator is right here. So it acts as your shaft, and the entire thing is surrounded by thick <laughs> quartz. I mean, the whole but shaft isn't this thick, huh? Mm -hmm. I think, keep the shaft from here. It's this thick. Right. That Amazing. is quality quartz. Okay, and then this area <laughs> is the receiving area. So we came from the foyer. Yes. So typically after your foyer, that's it. That's your receiving area. But this is the actual receiving area for guests who might want to stay for yeah, it's so warm and inviting. No? You just want to sit. I, I didn't love this metal sculpture. Right. It's so nice. It's so massive. Oh, speaking of, the owners are already here. So they've slowly started to move in. And a lot of the accents that you see or the decor that you see was picked by them already. Yeah. Yeah. Actually I heard that this was um, made on commission. Yeah. 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 A lot of their yeah. a lot of their pieces are yeah. they they're collectors though. They are. They are. They are. They are. I saw some pieces or collections from the bedrooms. Yeah. Although that's something that you know more of. <laughs> I just saw them and I like okay these are collectors. Yeah. Okay. But before we go there, do you mind going to the rooms first? Let's go around the rooms. Okay. okay. Sure. So let's go back to the foyer. How do you pronounce it? Foyer? Foyer. 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 For me, but I mean, I mean, technically they're both correct. Anything goes. <laughs> I mean, yeah. yeah. Okay. So, for context, guys, I know more about the ground floor, so I'm going to be touring Ria for this one. And can you guess what room this is? It's right next to your main entrance. What would you think it was? Quarters. <laughs> okay, so you are correct. Wow. <laughs> but this is the staff quarters. And I have to say, this is one of the more gracious staff quarters yes. I have ever seen. So you have your seating area, your um, sleeping area, and then you even have a vanity wow. right here. So vanity. Vanity. <laughs> your vanity, your built-in closet, and your ensuite, bath. toilet and bath. Nice. So this you know, these service quarters is bigger than most, um, you know. Oh yeah, it's definitely one of the bigger ones yeah. I have seen. Period. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure there are others. And they even have storage here. Yeah. Okay, so since this is the staff quarters, they made sure that it was easy for them to access the auxiliary or the everyday kitchen. Hello, po. Ganda ka po sa kitchen. Parang sarap din ang mga hoy. Julian kat pa sa carrots. Okay. So this is the dirty kitchen, which is very very clean. Yeah. And then this door leads to the, the basement, basement. Okay. Yeah, which we will, we will be going to later, but for now, keep that in mind. A solid one door. And then from the dirty kitchen, you have access to your formal kitchen. So lots of counter space, yes. but what I really like about this one is, well, you, you know that there's quartz. Yes. But then there's also premium quartz. Yeah. So this is of the higher grade variant. Oh, this looks very premium at all. And the lalaki ng cuts Exactly. Because the pattern itself, Italian quartz. It's so nice. So amazing. I love the cabinetry. It's very clean. Very clean. Even the way the built ins were. Ooh. Very streamlined. Very streamlined, exactly. Yeah. Very clean. And this is just the breakfast nook. This is uh, the dining breakfast nook. Breakfast nook. Yeah. So much counter space. And you have a TV, of course. <laughs> yes, of course. <laughs> to entertain. <And> TV. <laughs> also, um, by the way, the owners have not fully moved in. And that's the reason why some of the shelves are still empty. Mm -hmm. But they have started to put in most of their items. And also, this house is about 90% done only. It doesn't... Feel yeah, like does it. it look like it? It doesn't look like it's not finished. Ninety percent. So if you see anything that may not be 
finished yet, it's because it's only 90% done. <laughs> okay, so from your formal kitchen, we can then go to the dining. formal dining area. Wow. Ah, and you have a view of your backyard. Your such pool. a nice backyard and the pool mm -hmm. so these doors you can slide open para medyo ano siya the indoor breezy. outdoor breezy <laughs> feels mm -hmm. oh my gosh but I know you're gonna tell me all about that later okay kasi ikaw yung may alam dyan <laughs> okay this is another set of metal art no? yeah, it's so nice that here. see like this for example look at the boss oh yeah look <laughs> at Okay, now I want to say something about this door. So usually with big door, and I'm sure you see this yes. or have uh, dealt with this. Usually with big doors, uh, the hinge mm -hmm. isn't on the edge. It's usually around in this area, oh. right? But for this one, they invested in a pivot. So instead of a hinge that's normally located here, mm -hmm. they had a had pivots installed on the edge, talaga. Yeah. Para it functions like a real door without without the, well, hinges aren't messy, but you know, you can't see it. Yeah. So it looks even cleaner and it's sturdier. Yeah. The pivot hinge is very, um, the, the ones that they got are very high end though. Very, so it very has high to um, support this type of door, yeah, which is quite heavy. Because all of the doors, I believe, all are of the like doors, around yeah. 2.7. They are. Or, Including the second floor? Or more than 2. 9 feet, I think. 2.8. 2.8 per door. door. Every per door, door in here. Can and you then believe that? <laughs> ceiling height is 3.2, while the higher finished ceiling height is 3.3. So everything here is high ceiling. Yeah. So this isn't the only door that you will see here. That has similar a to the dining. Meron din yung. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I almost fell. Pala. <laughs> yeah, meron din yung papunta sa formal kitchen. And look at how nicely that closes. Especially since it's glass, you don't want it banging Bang, around. Yes. Right? Okay, so again, we're back to the receiving area. Let's now cross the floor. Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot one room. <laughs> There's another room here. Okay, so most houses have a powder room for the guests near the living room or the you know Entrance. the guests area mm -hmm. but this house has a female powder room and a male powder room very very commercial <laughs> very uh, no, uh, resort like almost and it's huge as well it's huge yeah for a powder room so you have the area where you can just wash your hands and again and again you have the premium quartz countertops for washing your hands and then yeah. it continues to this side where you can like this is the Water closet. I have a question. Water closet with another sink. Wow. I have a question. Is water closet an enclosed room or is it just a toilet? It's just a toilet. It's just a toilet, right? It's just a toilet, right? Okay, all right. So I was corrected previously and I, I had my really? doubts. Because okay. as far as I knew, the water closet was the yeah, toilet. Yeah, just a toilet. Right? Oh, really? Another room. So, yeah. Oh. yeah. So now we are clarifying that the water closet is the toilet. Okay, so you have your water closet <laughs> and your yes, sink in there's this. There's like a different interpretation for everyone. Yeah, but I think it hurts on which yeah. country. Yeah, but probably, but for the sake of the pre solo channel, this being in the Philippines. Yes, so the toilet like is the water closet. Yeah. Okay, so this is your enclosed stall room for your water closet. See, it's a room within a room. Yeah. Because <laughs> you know how people are, right? Like, they want to go to the bathroom all at the same time, so some of them can just prepare in the ante room <laughs> for the. <laughs> I guess. I know. This is the receiving area, yeah. So from your receiving area, this is the living room. So again, it's another very spacious room that's open. You can see, even if you close the doors, you can see your receiving area, your side garden, and your closed lanai or enclosed lanai. So I just want to point this out. So this is onyx. onyx. Oh, huh? okay. it looks awesome. Hindi lang ano eh. The light so isn't going through. Light. Yeah. My backlighting okay, yeah, it does. It's, it's more in me, so that's yeah, why you can't, you can't see it. So onyx is a type of um, translucent stone. Stone, yeah. So I'm pretty sure at night super yeah. nice net. It even has flecks of gold. It's already turned on. Kaso it's too bright. So wala lang ko, hindi lang quartz yung meron dito, but also onyx. Onyx, so yeah. It's a very premium material as well. Very. And all of the wood is teak. Even the ones on the ceiling which 
Pag may nadaanan tayo, mamaya, I'll show you. But, and the tiles. Did you notice the tiles? They're huge. <laughs> and we all know that the bigger the tiles are, the more premium they are. Yes. So these, um, we're not sure what kind of tiles they are, but they are Italian still. So I'm not sure if it's the homogeneous uh, porcelain or ceramic tile, but the fact that they're huge, not said yeah. premium. <laughs> so everything, teak, your tiles, your quartz, and your uh, onyx. Good choice of finishes. Yeah, this is the covered lanai. Covered lanai. Yeah, the covered lanai. So you can open it up, again, indoor-outdoor situation. But this is like their um, entertainment hub of sorts, because look at this one. So obviously you have a bar for entertaining, right? Yeah, <laughs> they have their DJ booth in here. Look at this. Wait, I'll turn that on. Oh, you ruined the surprise. I was going to show her that. <laughs> Anyways. Yeah, so this is also onyx. And at night, that reflects to the ceiling. It's so cool. Yeah, it's really nice. When I went in here, I was like, why does this bar look different? It doesn't look like um, quartz. It's like, oh, it's onyx and it lights up. But this part, this is quartz. And I like that they kept the CDs, the music it's in this area. Easy. Check it out. And the music, but it makes sense then, Yeah, because the wine is down here. Yeah, so this is entertainment. Ano talaga nila, like nook. So if you open that up and you have a party, dito in drinks, then you chill. Okay. And back out again into the receiving area and the main stairs actually this main stairs looks amazing from here but it looks even more amazing from the outside yeah. right okay so as much as so brung and stairs and i want to go up we still have more floors to cover or areas to cover on this floor so and okay. i know the magandang stairs from the outside and that's something you're gonna tell me about later yes on. okay you do want So right next to your living room, we have the den. So this could be any room. It could be a family room, but right now they're using it as a den, multi-purpose. Yeah. With a huge TV embedded on the wall. So there's like this huge um, sitting area, but then mm -hmm. with a dining table of sorts. So as so a multi-purpose, yeah, you know, we're in a family just yeah. hanging out here. Right? Mm -hmm. They could be playing board games over there, watching TV, etc. So. It's a very chill family spot that's still kind of private because they have so many seating areas. So. They do. It. And I hear they still plan to buy more. Wow. Yeah, or at least replace <laughs> some of them. But it's you know what? So this nice. is really nice. It this is. coffee table and this side table. And the side, well. table. The side table. The, the whole set is very really nice. Cute. This dress board, yeah. Actually, if you can it's zoom so in. Nice. You can really see the grain. Yeah. Feel the grain, not even see it. It's amazing. Kahoy. Kahoy da hao. Even this is a choice of um, stands. Yeah. Very simple, classic, modern, timeless. Speaking of wood, this one. Okay. This one is not teak. I like this part. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this one is not teak, but mm -hmm. this is a door that leads to the yeah, maintenance check. of the elevator. So, very easy. All of the floors have it. That way, you wouldn't have to. Because you don't know what you're doing in the elevator, right? If the entire thing is, sla uh, is quartz. So this is nice. Ingenious. And this... This is the male powder room. Oh, it's very so masculine, you, no? As compared to the ladies' yeah, powder room. Yeah, because the quartz there was white. This yeah. one is black or black marble. It's okay. It's okay. It's not so much on the counter. It still has that anti-room. <laughs> anti-room. So, and this and is the, oh. the actual powder room. <laughs> so this has a urinal. Yeah, and that's what makes it the a water closet. Yeah, oh. water closet you're seeing and a urinal. So the powder room is not for males, also for females. Yeah, I guess if, if the female is occupied, you can use this. Use this one. One. If you really had to go. <laughs> <laughs> if you didn't want to go. Okay, so if you want to go. And what's nice about these two rooms, actually, it's more important to Oh yeah, this is the one that you can see from the yeah. entrance. The female powder room is a little bit closer towards the elevator doors. And the final room on this floor 
which is also right next to the uh, entrance, is the oh, office. Okay. So easy access. And you also have a window looking over or to the facade of your house. Which, by the way, I forgot to mention earlier, the reason, or one of the reasons why they wanted the staff quarters to be right next to the main entrance, because so it looks like this, right? It has a huge yeah. window. Para kita nila pag may pumasok na. Sa gate. Okay. Yeah, so they can easily open or close the gate yeah. without any, you know, without having to like, check but from the back of the house. It's very smart space planning, right? right very there. practical. <laughs> So I love this table though. It's yeah. very organic. The texture is so nice. It's like a um, banana leaf. Yeah. <laughs> it's nice. No wooden. So I think they're still gonna do more. Yeah, I think um, they're gonna change up some yeah, stuff in to make room. it a little bit more modern. To fit Tabinga and yeah. owner, to fit the rest of the house. Yeah, <laughs> to fit the rest of the house. But as is, architecturally speaking, it's already nice. Because yeah, cool. this was um, renovated, no? Yeah. So the style before was. Yeah, um, so this was an existing house before. Mm -hmm. And in you know, Alice except for the skeleton. And the, the style before was Mediterranean. So yeah. like, they say it was pink. Oh, oh. I can't imagine it being pink. I'm not yeah. sure if we're going to show in the B roll or something. <laughs> I don't want to see that. And um, he modern, even no? said the, no, the word Scarface, right? Yeah. So I, According to I him, only there was a main stairs. Yeah. The main stairs looked like in something the entrance, from the so, yeah. I can't imagine, because right now the stairs is in the back. It's very modern. So, it's, it's, anyway. Anyway. Oh, so oh, it's that's one benefit of hiring a really good, good. developer or yes. constructor or uh, architectural Architect, firm. Yeah. They will make magic yes. using an existing structure. So the office has an ensuite toilet and bath. So you have with a closet also with built-in wardrobe, your vanity, a sink, uh, and your separate enclosed shower toilet. and water closet or mm -hmm. toilet. Yeah. So what I like about these, I'm not sure if you can put it on the other floor, say, but the glass, the tempered glass, is floor to ceiling. Yeah. And there are no rails in the bottom. All of it is carried by the rails at the top. So very sturdy, very high quality. And actually, those are expensive, right? Yes, very nicely done. So I mean, look at that. It, it jiggles a little bit, but considering it's only hanging from that, this can actually, that can actually withstand a heavier load, but I mean, if you're gonna go for quality, it's not going to So the fact that this has an ensuite toilet and bath means the office can be converted to a guest room or an extra bedroom oh. if they needed to, but as it is, this already has seven bedrooms, yeah. all with an ensuite toilet and bath. So, <laughs> sangayon they just need an office. But if they really wanted another bedroom, easier to convert. <laughs> yeah. Okay, that is the ground floor. Did I miss anything? No, I did not. So we are finally going to go to the basement and the basement only has two access points, the elevator and the driveway from the front. So we're just going to use the elevator. Oh, that's fast. <laughs> okay, so we're going to go to the basement and we'll see you there. Welcome to the basement. The elevator is a very commercial feel to it. Very fast, very responsive. Unlike most of the like residential, residential elevators that I see. I mean, a lot of homes probably have this kind of elevator. I just don't see it. But as far as what we tour in the channel, this is very impressive. <laughs> okay, so the basement, they didn't um, change much of it. Mm -hmm. They retained the existing part of the basement. So what we're seeing now is basically storage. So, of course, they cleaned up the paint. They, I mean, they repainted it. And then they left this room. This area is very huge as well. Mm -hmm. oh, so it's unfinished. So wow. it's un uh, this is the part where you can see that it's unfinished for now. There's no fixture. Kita pa yung mga hindi pa nasa sand, wala pa yung wala pa yung countertop. <laughs> but this one is new. And then everything else is ano pa? Um, hindi pa talaga tapos. Like the outlets, yung mga abang kita pa. But you can see the structure. And it could be a guest room again. Yeah. Like they have so many rooms. Or a very large, large house. A very large. Uh, <laughs> it could be a man cave, an entertainment area. And this is just storage. Wow. 
It's so neat. I love like most storage rooms are literally just rooms. This is kind of feels like a vault almost. I mean, kung kung buti na lang ano siya eh. Um closet doors eh. Pero kung malilito na drawers, mukha siyang Wow. Oh, and they have more of their collections. Okay, so let's not open everything kasi there are a lot of valuable items. <laughs> So even this, I think I believe this door um, was from the original house. Oh, okay. That explains why it's so classic. So I also like that this was maintained from the original structure. I love this. What do you call this again? Louvers, Louvers right? Louvers. So it's something that I think a lot of kids think are very old timey, mm -hmm. but it's very timeless in my it opinion. Has a, you know, a charm to it. it has a charm, exactly, exactly, and it's good for ventilation. <laughs> It looks good and it's good for ventilation. And then this door oh, is where your breakers are. Yeah, your electrical. Mm -hmm. So they're also using it as storage currently for some of the construction materials. But ago unliness. Okay, and then there's a door that leads out into the garage. Hi. Excuse me. <laughs> so pag bigyan na lang yung mga laundry. <laughs> so many animals okay so from here you can see that you have more storage spaces I assume these are for the check on all right I think it's a gas <laughs> and then these more storage yeah. then you have the stairs leading up to the dirty kitchen that I showed you guys earlier then right next to the stairs you have your laundry area, and I love this room. You have your laundry room, as in a solid laundry room. It's a linen, linen room, laundry room. I don't know. I love this because one of the very spacious. yeah, very spacious. Um, it's easy to do your actual laundry and then the folding, etc. Of course, the ironing, the storage. <laughs> <laughs> and that's that's something I think a lot of houses tend to forget the linen closet yes. this is a whole linen room <laughs> there's a <laughs> yeah. the built-in sink countertop and then on this side hello po sensya na okay lang ba so this is your driver's quarters so obviously the drivers have already moved in. So I have this much space, you have all of the built-ins. And this is also where the security system is. Yeah. So it doubles as your security room and your driver's quarters. It of course also has an ensuite, toilet and bath. <laughs> then right outside we have another counter <laughs> with the sink and turtles. <laughs> So of course they're not part of the house or they're the owners <laughs> as pets, but they're just swimming around as a pampalamig siguro. Siguro may nililinis mo ng tank or something. And then you also have stairs that lead up to the... Okay, this one doesn't lead back into the house. This one leads into the outdoor units of the air conditioning. Oh, okay. So all of the outdoor... Oh, oh. Lahat ng outdoor units nila nasa sides lang ng bahay. Wala sa harap, wala sa likod. Kasi yun yung kita eh. Diba? So the architect thought of that. Kailangan madali maintain kailangan tago para maganda pa rin. Slats. Ang ganda. I, lo I love that idea. I'm so glad they did that. And also, by the way, the cistern is over here. It's a little bare. And dito lang siya. But again, this house isn't completely finished. So, and then, we're not gonna go through this, but you can see that the ramp is really nice and it also has stairs. On the sides, it's easy to scale up or down. And yeah, that is the basement. This, by the way, this house is a 10 car, has a 10 car oh, slot. Wow. Yeah. So combined na yon between, hi! <laughs> so many animals. <laughs> combined in between the basement and the uh, driveway in the front. So in total, 10 cars. So even if your whole family was here with guests, no problem. Okay, so now, hi again! So cute! Wagging your tail! 
Okay, but we're shooting right now though. So now it's time, I think, that you show me around the second floor. Okay, let's yeah. go. Okay. Hello, excuse me. <laughs> okay, so, direction of the second floor. I'm not even sure. I don't know. Because I didn't look at the second floor. Oh. You're going to have to show me around. Okay. Let's start with the... Yeah. Let's start with the... And what? So, okay. So before we go into the rooms, let's appreciate the foyer from here. It's such a nice view, you know. And the chandelier is very nice. And this is the same chandelier that I'll show you later. They use it there also on the other side of the stairs. So there's like a bit of symmetry going on. Yeah. And there's a balcony area here that overlooks the street. Yeah. So according to architect, um, this has a view of the, the sunset, and the other side has a view of the sunset. Sun. Uh, and so, the sun, right? sunrise. Sorry. <laughs> so, okay. So yeah. sunset, sunset and sunrise. And sunrise. So, so pag nahita pa nila yung garden mamaya, and imagine oh. that with sunrise. So Brenda. So yeah, that they sometimes hang out here. So right now, you do nativity scene, but yeah. they hang out here so most of the time. Most likely. I can imagine yeah, another seating arrangement yeah. here. And I noticed that everything is wood, so yeah. I'm assuming that all of this is teak. As yes, well. uh oh. Yes. And it's really real teak. wood teak yeah. also. Yeah. It's not laminate, it's, it's not it's like yeah. solid. So all of it, like the whole house, is like cladded with teak wood. So yeah. teak wood is a type of wood that very that fares very well with outdoors. Perfect. So para we have the elements. That's why they used so that. much of it outside. Yes. Okay. okay, so now let's get into the rooms. So let's start with this room. So I believe this is like the largest of the um, bedrooms. Aside from the master bedroom, this is one of the larger bedrooms because this is for um, one of the sons with a family. So they have like a huge family um, area over here and the well, bed here. I know this is um, so. Huge. Yeah, so the whole second floor has um, Nara wood from um, Brazil, and it's um, 14 inches. Yung width, yeah. So yeah, it's it's yeah, it's it's really nice though, and I, I think um, this was like from old stock. So it's very I know. So they did it so 10 years ago. So so it's it's. But it's supposed to be sustainable. Yeah. 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 Uh, 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 yes. So, this is the so ensuite uh, <laughs> toilet and bath. So again, they use quartz. Oh, wow. It looks so, so much bigger uh, as well. Than you know, later on, you'll see that um, all of the countertops are quartz now. Yeah. But then all of them have like different um, styles. Styles, textures, designs. Yes. Uh, so this one is like. Um, it's beige, yeah, brown, yeah, yeah, with like specks, marble, yes. Uh, with silver specks, because you can use the black gold specks. Yes, uh -oh. so it's different. Uh, I like how subtle that is, but it's really good. Yeah. Subtle changes, but it still looks consistent. Yeah. So all of the mirrors also are floating with um, backlight. Yeah, uh, I can see that. Yeah. I like that this one also has a skull on the yeah. mirror. <laughs> so it's, it's very... For scones. 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 Yeah. Okay. Alright, so my friend just <laughs> <laughs> My friend who's an interior designer. Mine is. I was like, oh, is it scones? <laughs> you can yeah. also say wall lights. You know? Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, I usually say, uh, say wall uh, lights. Uh, make it simple. So, yeah. So, these look similar to the rooms downstairs. So, these, yeah. if I'm not mistaken, are lemons. Yes. So, they are uh -huh. not solid teak. Yes, but they do have like that texture that makes them look. Uh, that makes it look like. Um, it looks like a wood. Okay. Yes. This is a very um, particular type of handle and they made sure that it's very um, you know, um, streamlined yeah, as well. Definitely very so cool. like there's like that line from the ceiling to the to floor. The floor. Just makes nice. everything look even taller. So this is still 3.2 meters. Yeah. And it looks even taller. And even deeper because of this, which is also storage. Right. Yeah. Oh my. Okay. Okay. This is something that won't translate in the video, but when you hold it, 
Imbakanya. I'm robust. Because mm -hmm. a lot of finger holds feel like aluminum, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. This is not yeah. aluminum. So it's, it's so a very solid. special type of handle, actually. Mm -hmm. Okay. So again. Okay. And you still have the that floor to ceiling uh, tiles. Um, I don't know, the, uh, tempered glass. Oh, tempered glass, okay. Oh, this is something that the architect mentioned earlier, actually. Mm -hmm. He prefers to have the glass or the enclosures mm -hmm. floor to ceiling to the oh, as opposed to okay. other firms who usually like use up to, know, it's usually like just up to, yeah, right? 2.1, 1.8. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sometimes, yeah. Mm -hmm. So he doesn't like using that. He prefers oh, a full on. ceiling to floor okay. tempered glass. Which prevents the moisture from spreading into the rest yes. uh -oh. of the which, which, sorry, which <laughs> makes sense. Because you are using wood. We don't want moisture. Mm -hmm. yeah, even if it's wood. Okay. okay. So this is one of the bigger regular rooms. Yes, bigger regular rooms. <laughs> but wait till you see the master bedroom later on. Yeah, it's it's huge! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hey. And as you can notice, also all of the doors, no, two point seven, eight, two point eight, eight, high. Okay, so this next room is actually for the unika iha, oh. the granddaughter. <laughs> I think the first, she was the first couple. So this ah, room is for her. Okay. It's not even for the kids, no, but the granddaughter. The granddaughter. I think. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So it's it's really you know um you can see the design, no, it's for. There's, there's like hints of blue. I mean, this yeah. isn't part of the architects. Yeah, but this is part <laughs> so of the architects. Though, but no, but wow. yeah, I think they plan to put it there though. Most probably. I like... Yeah, this is a nice touch. I like how the hanging lights over here complement the slats here. And what they do is like... Um, it's as, 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 Sorry, asymmetrical. Yeah. So only I think, one side. yeah. So it's only one side, but I think they pla they should like offset it with like something over something here, tall. which you'll see later in the other room. Mm. Uh -huh. Okay. 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 So the ensuite toilet and bath. Yes, the ensuite toilet and bath. Similar layout to the one earlier, but it's wider. Yes. And this is different. Yes. So you see the parts now. It has blue specks on it. Yeah. Which which looks very premium because you know usually you know it's parts kind of like this color. Yeah. I mean, when you um, quartz pala, panga as like a material, it's very expensive. You plain quartz, lalo na with I this know. pattern. No? This <laughs> is obviously uh, definitely on the higher end spectrum yes. of quartz. Uh, so you see the um, the floating mirrors again with mm -hmm. backlight, no? And behind the floating mirrors are uh, fluted tiles. Yeah, so you know the the light hits it very yes. like differently, no? As compared to like smoother, so, yeah. yeah, the smoother tiles. Well, it has a marble yes. design. I'm not sure if it's marble. Marble, we should ask the architect later on. Yeah. I think some of the marble um, items, I'm not sure here in this bathroom, or, or Kalahata marbles, which is very kind of yeah. premium, premium again, again, premium yeah. <laughs> material. Oh, I'm sorry, I touched the mic. I also like that they installed the shower at the yeah. reachable height because yeah. this is the girl's room. Yes. I mean, she's gonna grow up taller yeah. eventually. Mm -hmm. Let me continue. And she has a balcony. Yeah, all of the rooms <laughs> have balconies. All of them have balconies. Wait, except the other except one. Except the, the, the one in front. Yeah. Oh, I believe that that first granddaughter is a 12. Really? Yeah. Oh, I, yeah, I, I wasn't able to, to get her. I was able age. to talk to the owner earlier. Oh, okay. okay. Sorry, I don't know. A 12 year old with a room like that, I would be yeah. very happy. Yeah. <laughs> Comment down below if you would have also loved to have a room like that at 12 years old. Okay, wait. So, this is another seating area. Yes. So, this is the family hall. Yeah, family, family hall. area. Family hall. So it's and another. All pictures. Yeah. We're not going to zoom in on that, but all the family pictures are there. And they're adorable. <laughs> and very convenient because this is a pantry, right? Um, yes. Somewhere we're going to have the same hand. Oh, linen! Oh, okay. Oh, that's nice. And I thought all the linen were in the linen room, but 
this is wow. this is very well organized. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Color coded. <laughs> Here at least. I know. <laughs> Oh, hey. So, um, this room naman is the daughter's room. Oh, hey. Ah, okay. Who also has a family of her okay. own. Yes. So, this is a huge area. Yes. Um, she's, um, she's very much into yoga. Oh, that's yes. this much open space. Yes, this much open space. And that, um, this also explains why her view is of the pool area. It's very calming, no? A calming. Yes. yes. I think it's so. Yeah. <laughs> and she also has a balcony area here. Oh. It's a lot bigger than the one than the one yeah. has. <laughs> Magugulat ka kasi the other oh. room naman has a bigger balcony. Oh, okay. So, right. so it gets better. <laughs> yeah, it gets better. <laughs> it gets better. Okay. Oh, I love how you really can't see. Oh, I love how you really can't see all of the teak from anywhere. Yeah. It's amazing. <laughs> okay. So she Very has awesome. like one of the larger bathrooms. Yeah. Okay. Wow. So um, this was, uh, I, I believe that she has this one is less her um, meditation area also, her oh. quiet area. So this also is like a studio for her. That right? makes sense. Yes, yeah, so that makes sense. There's <laughs> okay. Error here. Okay. Okay. So yeah, so this is her like quiet area. I think. So that's why there's so much, so much space, space over to here. Move and again with a separate yes. so all of the rooms with an ensuite toilet and bath have a separate toilet or water closet and yes, shower and shower yes. area. Which so again, quartz. Oh, hit the mic again. But then a different type of quartz. This one looks <laughs> similar to, to the, the one, one in the kitchen. kitchen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So this is the one in the kitchen, but I don't know if it's exactly yeah. the same thing. So quartz again, thing. fluted tiles over here behind the mirror. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm sure this looks really nice at night. I mean, right now you can already see it, but. More so at night, I bet. Mm -hmm. Nice. So still, Nara looks... Ah, I love how you can see the different shades. Yes. <laughs> so it looks very natural and very yeah. mm -hmm. tropical. <laughs> Please notice no. a mm -hmm. jam. <laughs> yeah. It's like a super door. And yes. the main stairs. Yes, this is the stairs. Oh, wow, look at that <laughs> view though. So yeah, as you can see, the, the chandelier is the same as the one in front, yeah. right? Yeah. yeah. Okay. We're gonna go down there later because I think that's the only way we can go. Yeah. To you the, should, to the you backyard. should um, take a look at these stairs. Yeah. Have you noticed they're um, cantilevered? Yeah, they are. I, I don't know if that's the right term, but um, architect explained to me that they're connected to I-beams. Mm -hmm. So that's why you don't really see the support, but ah. on the sides, it's connected to i beams. Okay, I think like we're going to be able to see that from the outside, right? Yes, from the outside. That's amazing. <laughs> ah, okay, yeah, okay. I can see yeah. some of the bolts. Right. Yeah, we, we can look at that closer later. Also, there's jealousy. Yeah, I love enough. that. I know. I think it's a trend that's coming back. Huh? It is. I'm glad it's coming back because as much as people... Because <laughs> as much as people, like there was a time people didn't like jealousy windows, yeah. right? Because they quote unquote too much I don't no, agree I with that. It's nice, yeah, and it's very good for ventilation. Yeah, exactly, very practical, good for ventilation. When it, you get like when the rain yeah. uh, hits a certain way, mm -hmm. you know, jealousy prevents it because it's angle siya. Of course, there are certain jealousies that look cheap. Mm -hmm. These, however, are obviously on the high end side. Yes. <laughs> like everything else. Like in everything this house. else in this project, <laughs> in this house. Okay. So should we? Also, I appreciate okay. that. Yeah, it's high ceiling, and you have a bit of cold. Pero limited yung cold niya. Mm -hmm. Because my issue with cold lighting is it's hard to clean. Oh. So right. these, in my opinion, are easier to clean because they're These not are straight lines. Yeah. And they don't go around your room. They don't go around. Or they're not in like the edges of um, rooms where in again corners. You can't really see what you're yeah. cleaning. So I don't know. It's very practical. Yeah. <laughs> so this is the master bedroom, but okay. we, before we get into that, let's check go. the other rooms yes. first. Okay. So this room naman, has the largest balcony. Ah. Yes. But this one is in the front. Yes, oh. it's in the front. Facing the front. 
So this um, this room is um, one of their son's room. Wow. Okay, okay, that's um, a lot of space. Yeah, he has a lot of space. So again, look how look how um, yeah the, the slats. Yeah, is so it too bright the, if I open this? Okay, so this is the balcony, the um, huge balcony. This is a big balcony and I love that, okay, so it's kind of hard for me to explain it to you guys verbally. This would have been easier if I had a whiteboard or something. Mm -hmm. Pero kasi yung facade, yung driveway, the space is bigger on this side of the lot. Mm -hmm. So this balcony from the outside makes it look even. Like parang... Oh. When it we drove up here, out. yeah. When we drove up here, like wow, that facade is impressive. Although I'm pretty sure you saw it from the, from the uh, intro when we came in, right? So there's no balcony on the other side. There is one here, but it feels so balanced still. And also, this is the sun's room. Yes. Imagine entertaining your friends here. That's that's it's nice. nice at night. Yes. Mm. Shouldn't even end with the a sunset. <laughs> <laughs> this is the sunset, ah. right? And even if you can see your neighbors, your neighbors, and that's the beauty yeah, of living here, to be honest. Mm -hmm. One of the things you're paying so you for. You still have like a bit of privacy. Wait, this isn't mine. This is mine already, okay. Just making sure. Oh my god. Let's leave it open for the camera. Camera, okay. Oh my god, nothing but the camera. Okay, so we have this really nice bed. Yes. With the the slats lights again. here. Oh, yeah. With the high lights here, and it's balanced by this table. Lamp. This is what you meant earlier. Yeah. So mm -hmm. most likely, the Unika Ihe's room will have maybe something similar. Yeah. Hopefully, 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 because yeah. it's not finished yet. Yeah. And this okay. is obviously his desk. desk. All it needs is the office chair. Mm -hmm. And oh, a linen and closet. Yeah, it's a linen. He closet. has his own linen closet. Yeah. <laughs> the only reason I was. Kind of confident to open this is because it says bed sheets and towels. <laughs> it's like okay, it's not too personal of no. stuff. Oh, oh this is it. interesting. So this is one of the bigger bathrooms, I think. Oh, his his walk-in closet or it's uh, quite ensuite toilet bath looks a little different. Yeah. So the here the quartz again. It's dark brown this time. Yeah, so on the darker side. Specs, oh, yeah. Because I siguro they know that it's for the sun. Yeah. Maybe make it a little bit yeah. more masculine. Although it's still very neutral to be honest. So this, this I, I can assure you, an architect even said so that the um, tiles are Kalahata, so from uh, Italy. Yeah. So it's premium. Yeah. Again, premium. Premium. <laughs> so a bit of fun fact for you guys, Kalahata marble is one of the premium <laughs> <laughs> kinds of marble that you can find. So even so it's from with, Italy. Yeah, it's from Italy. So you will see even with cheaper tiles, they try to emulate the look yeah. of Calacara, but, but when you see it in person, you really can't fake it. Yeah, <laughs> you really can't fake it. Okay. So yeah, so this is a wow. huge closet. <laughs> Arguably, this is bigger yes. than the than the daughter's yeah. room. Yeah. The difference is that one was wider, mm -hmm. like you had more space to, to dance, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> but this one is longer, more narrow looking. It's not actually narrow. I mean, hello. We can <laughs> we can both stand here. That's how much space you have. <laughs> and I think that alone, the storage over there are for shoes ah, only. Plus these. Plus these. <laughs> all right. Some people. Yeah. They're all collectors. Not all I of them. Think, yeah. Even the sun. So yeah. Again, you see it's high pressure laminate. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, this is consistent though, uh, across all with, of the yes, walking closets. They use the same walking closets. With this um, hardware, floor to ceiling hardware. So again, the shower and toilet separate. area. Separate. Mm -hmm. separate. This, this is ensuring basically that even if the son gets his own family, the whole family yeah. can stay here. In one yes. Okay. Is this also laminate? It looks so good. <laughs> it's a solid wood. Okay. Okay. So, so it's let's go to master the bedroom. master bedroom. This video is sponsored by Carousel, the leading online platform for buying and selling new and secondhand goods. In Carousel, everyone wins. Buy, sell, give. Anything goes. So for the master bedroom, I think we have to remove our shoes. Okay. Sure. No problem. This is no why problem I wear for boots. You. <laughs> <laughs> One zip and it's on. Okay. Okay. So, um, this area is quite huge. 
The master oh. bedroom with a ensuite toilet and bath. It's it totals around 180 square meters. 180? Yes. So, Just the master bedroom and the ensuite toilet and bath. Yeah, so it's it's like larger than most like three bedroom condominiums, condominiums right? Yeah. So this is the receiving area. <laughs> I thought and you were gonna say like it's something below 100, maybe close to 100 <laughs> square meters. 180? Yeah. So this is um I think the, okay. if. Yeah, if I remember correctly, this area is just 90 square meters. This yes. is the 90. And then, okay. and then the toilet this and bath. This is bigger than most two-bedroom condominiums. Yes. Okay. And the toilet and bath is also 90 square meters. So, 90-90 sila. <laughs> okay. Alright. Okay. Let's digest this one first. Yes. I'm, I'm excited to check the toilet <laughs> and bath. Yeah. But let's check out this one first. So, they have a huge seating area that's not cramped at all. You have yes. this huge... Is this... Indian rug? Yes. This rug is from India and I really like the color. The texture is I mean, I'm wearing socks, blue, but I can tell. <laughs> the texture mm -hmm. is nice. So you can oh, see man, like hints gray, of blue everywhere. Blue. Very and neutral, also here are the accessories. Color. You know they have oh, like Ladro Mora Morano pieces. Morano. So, and lapis azul. Az lapis lapis azuli. Lapis azuli. Lazuli. Yeah. So yeah. Which is something I only so, see in history books. <laughs> they're also, you know, they're, and they're collectors. Um, <laughs> kitang kitang yeah. mo yung pagka collector nila dito sa collection. So, the, the homeowners are into fine china and art yes. and decor. The son is into collecting, yeah. well, shoes, which is in itself a very expensive hobby. Yes. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. We have so, a simple setup over here, yes. although I think this, some of their yeah. accessories aren't like here yet. I yes. Because based from the, based from what we've seen, I would imagine this had something in it, mm -hmm. <laughs> right? Yeah. Oh, this, oh but yeah. this. <laughs> so this, <laughs> this is something. Such a nice view, right? Can we open it? Yeah. So the, the this, I think this room has wow. like the nicest view. That breeze. <laughs> yeah. This room has definitely has the nicest view, I think. Okay, obviously a really big balcony as well, but yeah, mm -hmm. that view. Yeah. And with the pine trees. Look at the pine trees. <laughs> pine, pine trees! They have pine trees. It's, oh, it's a mango tree, right? Amazing, yes. And I then think, in yeah. the distance, you just see trees, trees, and then sky. <laughs> it's like you're not in the city. Yeah. Like, well, I mean, you're in Ayala Labang, but... Yeah, but still, you know, it's like more... No, this is uh, one of the provincial. better lots. <laughs> yeah. It's definitely one of the better lots in they don't Ayala really see a, Labang. a lot of houses, right? Yeah, because the one in front, yeah, you can see your neighbors. But this one, you do not yeah. have neighbors in this view. If I'm not mistaken, this is close to the uh, country club? Yes. Oh, I believe that's why. so. Yeah, so that's what we're seeing, just land and trees and sky. And your gorgeous swimming pool, a preview already, it's sparkling in the huge, afternoon sun. Yeah, it's such <laughs> a huge garden, no? And so, swimming oh. pool. And actually, okay. I talked to the, I'm so impressed because I talked to the owner mm -hmm. and she said that this was all her doing because she loves plants. Wow. Okay, so it's, this was, except wow. the pine trees. I think the pine trees were already here to begin with. Oh, but really? like, the gardening, wow. that was just her. So. And it's really nicely done. Compliments this really nice house. Hold on. So the balcony has a bit of seating, probably where they have coffee in the mornings or breakfast. So what's in here? And ex oh. it, it extends up to there. Oh. Yeah, so that's okay, where the so outdoor the units, units are. So again, very easy to maintain. And it also doesn't hurt that your neighbors also look nice. Yeah. <laughs> like the houses themselves are also nice. Okay, so now let's go to. Oh, you still have those slats, but this is different. This one is more uniform yes. than the ones we saw earlier. Okay, nice touch. Oh, I and also, I like how consistent the wood that they chose are. Yeah, the wood tone stuff. Oh, this, is, this one looks like the one from the sun's room as well, like the same color. So they didn't really vary the choice of wood too much to make it look consistent. Okay, I so this is the. On oh, sweet toilet and bath, which is 90 square meters. So they have like another vanity area here. Okay, wait, let's go. Which this I side think first. is also like an office, no? Yeah, yeah, it feels like an office because they have two office chairs. Yeah. Mesh office chairs. But yeah, it's a vanity. Yes. A huge and one. The, the mirror is floating yeah, as well with backlight. With some wall lights or scones. Thank you for telling me it's scones. 
Okay, so... Oh, and more kalakara? Yes, more yeah. kalakara. And then the separate... Oh, these are bigger. They're separate yes. um, shower and water closet. This is bigger. It's and bigger. it also has its own um, urinal. Yeah, it has a And water closet. Oh, what's different with this one is there's frost. It's frosted. Oh, right. The others are transparent. So, oh, they want to keep their privacy. <laughs> Even inside. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. Bye. Coffee in the morning or tea. So, again, quartz. Oh, the pattern. Has a big pattern. Mm -hmm. Love that. Yeah. His and hers. Brava. And fluted tiles again. Fluted tiles. This one, also, the fluted tiles here have a pattern as well. Right. The ones earlier, they were sort like, of a You don't really green, see much of the green. pattern. Yeah. So, this is like the premium, premium, premium. <laughs> the really premium, premium. one. <laughs> so, I okay. love that, um, you know, in most pastor um, T and B, you know, mm -hmm. you have two sinks. Yeah, the his and hers. I'm sorry, I had to pee because I was very curious. I'm mm -hmm. It's snacks. <laughs> oh! They have a mini pantry. Yeah, so the, they have a pantry in the family like hall area, area. But then they have their own. <laughs> Probably so that the grandkids can get it. <laughs> I Bow guess. Low seats. Okay, oh so no, this is the walk-in closet. Is huge! Okay. Which is huge again. Walk-in closet. Your bag storage. Wow. Does this slide up or no? I'm not gonna <laughs> And I'm scared. <laughs> so okay. again, it's it's very consistent, this yeah. one. So you can really like feel the texture. But it's high pressure laminate. And um, very um, nice uh, streamlined handles. Yeah. You know what I like? Uh, this is something, again, that I see, that we see in person that doesn't mm -hmm. translate as much to the camera. But when you look at surfaces from a certain light, the reflection from the pin lights, you can see just how flush things are. So actually, the little imperfections get magnified whenever you look at it from like like this. <laughs> okay. So I'm happy to report that everything so far that we have seen here, incredibly flush, even the paint, mm. which I'm sure you know, paint yeah. takes careful work for it to be perfect. Yes. So, so far, everything is perfect. Everything is very seamless. And mm -hmm. you, know, you, you know that they really like put attention to yeah. every detail, every minor detail every in the detail. house. And again, oh, the Nara. <laughs> like, even when you do this to the edges of each plank. Mm -hmm. Oh man, it's so finely done. It's amazing. Okay. okay. So, so is that it for the second floor? Yeah, it is. I think it is. And also, I just I have to say this again. I appreciate how when you go out into the hallway, it's just very space. Open, right? <laughs> yeah, they love collecting things. And even, I would say they even love collecting seating areas <laughs> or uh, seating furniture. They have so much. But still, because the space is so huge, it does not feel cramped or filled. Again, this is 1,500 square meters of floor area. So that's it for the second floor. Shall we go outside? Yes, please. So, so this gorgeous staircase, no? Yeah. Oh, I love it. Senorita steps, right? Or if it's not Senorita, it's at the very minimum of minimum, the standard yeah. step. It's so light on the knees. And I really love the view that you see from here, the glass. The it's all glass. The entirety mm -hmm. of the background, the pine trees. And the yes. Tree. Amazing. Hey. Okay. And I'm glad that we went here during this time of day because you can really see the cool stuff. Uh, you know, you, don't, you can't really it's feel it on camera, but it's very breezy, it's right? Windy. Thanks to the And jealousy. very windy. Oh, thanks to the jealousy. <laughs> yeah, these are the good kinds. Yeah, and it's black aluminum as well. Okay. Oh, they have to take down the tree. And it's so nice. I mean, if I had a tree like this, I probably would want yeah. So I believe there's a door leading out to the backyard. Yes. This one I think is unfinished. So. Yeah. I don't get but it you see the, one, the, uh, the structure. It looks like the window from the yeah. sun's. No, 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 from the daughter's, the daughter's room. Yeah. So it, it actually um, goes straight there. Oh, up there. Well, that's yes. Why it looks yes. Okay, hold on. Let's hold the door for John. <laughs> <laughs> hey, John. Okay. Yeah. Uh, 
you see more of the teeth. Yes. Oh. Yeah. Okay. And it's soft close, right? 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 Yes. Soft close. <laughs> right? 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 <laughs> okay. So, so even the outdoor door is soft close. So. This is what we're trying yes. to do. Yes, so let's let's take a moment to appreciate the stairs. Maybe from here, <laughs> from this angle. Yeah, it's floating. Yes, it's floating because of the I beams that they strategically cut and placed over here so that it connects here, 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 here. So it goes around the um, exterior or the structure of the stairs. And also, it's clad in teak. So, yeah. so, so I'm appreciating such a weird yes. part of the stairs because I don't often get to see something like this. Yes. So it's, it's actually an architectural marvel. Yeah. So. Props to the I mean, we are featuring yes, APL we are fe architects. Yes. So, so this is, this there. is amazing. Oh, hey. So um, that gazebo over there is a new structure. Okay, let's I go. Believe. Let's go. Let's go. To yes. I know we should be talking about the, the pool, swimming but pool later. Later. On the end. Later. So as you, um, it's unfinished again. Mm -hmm. okay. But this one looks quite nice. Look at the distressed wood here. Well, it's this one. The I, mean, it's I don't think this is quartz. No, it's not. Yeah, it's probably not. It's wood. <laughs> yeah, it's plywood. I think. Mm -hmm. I love the lights over here, no? Because so nice. like with the, when the wind, um, so I they, know. I don't know, <laughs> what do you call that? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, I don't so, know what it's called. It so that, okay, zoom in a little bit. Is there something behind? This? Yes, so oh. behind our um, bathrooms so for the girls and the boys. <laughs> <laughs> so oh. parang yung powder room lang, meron oh. for the boys, meron for the girls. And uh, it's quartz also. <laughs> <laughs> Do we really want to expect anything less? Yes. Oh, so this is the boys because there's a urinal. Mm -hmm. Okay, so they and the shower the, area. They don't have the standard tiles, yes, but, yes, it's, but it's still but different, quite. Yeah. Still textured, yes. This is similar to the yeah. sun's room. Sun's room, yeah. And quartz. That <laughs> <laughs> well, that's a fixture, but still. Ah, it's this nice is touch. the only toilet and bath that you need for the ceiling you oh. that. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, I mean, this but is it's still higher than usual. Mm -hmm. And it's not hanging from the ceiling. Yeah, but the new hardware again. Yeah. Uh, so it rolls <laughs> kind of like a barn door. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Next. So let's see. Okay, so this one. I'm assuming for the girls area now. <laughs> There's an outdoor shower for when you can so, It's quite oh, similar it's actually, yeah. Except it doesn't have a urinal because it's for <laughs> girls. Yeah, so is. the quartz. Yeah, it's similar to the other side. And the same kind of space. Yeah. The HPL, the sliding door mechanism, mm -hmm. and lights. The lights, I can see. How many of you have done that now? Oh, light bulb. Ah, <laughs> so there. Also, so I think this is the bitter. basement. Ah, that leads to the basement, right? Yeah. And there's another storage room over here. Oh, this is for the pump. Oh, for, um, for, the, swimming for the swimming pool. Okay. This way, access is not I didn't see this from the outside. So apparently, it also has access to the. Outdoor. Garage. Yeah, the, the garage and the outer units. And the outer units on this side. Mm -hmm. So welcome. Any angle you look at it, except for Uh oh. Especially the one over there. You have to see the view of the house from there. It's amazing. How do we get it? Pwede here, pwede everywhere. So the pool. See the pool. The pool. Sorry. It's infinity. Is it? Yeah, it is. Yeah, it's it's somehow, it's yeah. I wonder how deep. Parang this side is shallow. Yeah. For sure. It doesn't look that deep though. Yeah, that's pretty shallow. So yeah, that one infinity. You know, I have to hand it to people who can really take care of their garden. I mean, I'm sure the owner isn't alone in taking care of this. 
but still. <laughs> no. Oh wow. That is impressive. Right. The facade of the house looks very nice from here. It's amazing. This is around 4 feet. 45 feet? Four really? Not, I mean, I'm not mm -hmm. sure. It's 8 or 7 feet. Oh, okay, so there is. There's still a little. Yeah, so there's So this is used as a putting area. You oh, see the golf course? Oh, okay. That's mm. nice. So it's such a about. huge area, though. Know? Especially when you look at it from here. Yeah. And I thought the facade looked huge. Yeah. It's even bigger from the back. It looks very nice, talaga. And can you imagine like entertaining people here? Right. I so can. <laughs> Especially during the holidays when your family's here, family and friends. Yeah. Amazing. Love is a good at night. It feels like we walked a lot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> This so was a big floor project. Area was what? One it's 1,500 square meters of floor area wow. and then 2,000 square meters of lot area, which shows both and the front and the backyard area. has a lot of space. I swear. <laughs> 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 it's good. We rolled around. And even just looking at the structure, right? So from the outside, it looks like you have two floors, but then it has a basement mm -hmm. and it has seven. Bedrooms with all with an ensuite toilet and bath, and then it can fit ten cars. So enough for your I really family. Love the facade. <laughs> From here, huh? Yeah. It's even more not not a lot of people really like take into consideration the back part. Yeah. Of the house. They, they tend here, to forget about the back. Yeah. But this, the back is Amazing. almost more impressive. Hi, hi. architect. Hi, hi. hi. Sorry, hi, join lady. us. Hello. So hello. How did you find a house? We Amazing. love it. We love it. We were just saying how usually people tend to forget about the back side of the house and they give so much emphasis on so the, the front. front. Right, right. So, so here you with can this really one, see that there was like really yeah. um, attention put into the yeah. details. Don't get us wrong, the front was amazing. Yes. But this one also. Even more. <laughs> thank you, thank you. We really amazing. wanted to showcase the back side because the rear side of the house is where the focal point is. Oh. Yeah. So the floating, or I would really say this is a suspended staircase, yeah. which is yeah. like staircase holding on to that curtain wall, is really one of our main feature here, yeah. which is stretching out to our sort of infinity, infinity pool. pool. Mm -hmm. Which is how deep, by the way, like more or less. This is like really, uh, I would say that feet? it's very friendly for children, just four feet. Four oh. feet, yeah. 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 standard uh, <laughs> depth that we <laughs> produce right now. Uh, the, the the deeper end has been a, a thing of the past. Yeah. 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 So. I agree. <laughs> I'm, I'm I'm glad you guys don't lean more towards that. <laughs> okay. All right. So, uh, and actually, I was mentioning earlier how I loved that there was so much teak on the exterior. Yes. Looking at it now from the back, wow, the entire <laughs> the entire <laughs> house is teak. Sad. Yeah. It's amazing. And I'm sure this is just going to get better over time because That's of right. character. Right. The teak right? is very resilient. Yes. And these teak woods are actually imported. And all you have to do is just whale it. And that's it. That's it. Yeah, it's just the stand uh, standard maintenance that you have to undertake. Mm -hmm. But basically, I think it's very doable. It's really meant for the outdoors. Yes. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. For sure. And another thing that I noticed about this house was how you use really high quality or premium or high-end finishes and yes. materials <laughs> which tell us that it's yeah. gonna last for a very yeah. long time which in the end is very sustainable yes that's true right, right. It, because we are really concentrating on the looks the aesthetic on this particular project is very very important and our client is also quite particular with the outcome you can tell so, with the way yes. she organizes <laughs> the personal items. Yeah. You can tell they're very I think particular. It's one architect's dream to have a client that is uh, willing to Definitely. invest on certain items because it really shows. Yeah. The, the the beauty of it is practically showcased as well. Yeah. yeah, and we are so glad that you were able to find a client that was able to showcase what you or can can do or what your firm can do 
and we are so glad that you were able to invite us here. Yeah. Is there anything else that you would like to say to our pre-solo family? Yeah. I think if uh, you would need our services, basically click, click on the uh, link below. And Priscilla, our partners, will be more than happy to connect put you us guys all together. Yeah, <laughs> for sure. So again, if you guys fell in love with the way they designed and created this house, you can get in touch with them through our website. So thank you guys again. Thank you. This thank is you. Ria, I, Julia, and architect Philip. And thank you for watching another episode of Priscilla BYO or Build Your Own. And we hope to see you again real soon with another episode. And you know how it is. Invest in your future. Invest with us. And invest with Priscilla. See you next time. Hey guys, if you haven't already subscribed to our channel, make sure you click here. And if you want to see more house tour videos, click right here. And we also have this new thing called Working Lunch with Priscilla, where I and a few random people talk about a few random things related to uh, real estate. So if you want to join in on the conversation, make sure you click right here. <laughs> <laughs>